Hi, I'm Faye, and today I have a grunge get ready with me. Um, my bangs are not cooperating today, but you know what? Whatever. Um, I this is the final look. So if you want to get ready with me and see how I do this makeup look and put together this little outfit with me, keep on watching. It's kind of like a Kinder Horish. Granny Love, Cat Beale, and kind of inspired look. But let's get into it. I first used the sunscreen primer. Also, if you judge me for how dirty my makeup is, you're anti grunge. And then I used that pink um, e.l.f. primer. And then I used this e.l.f. yellow color corrector. And you'll find that I use a lot of e.l.f. And I just put it under my eyes, around my nose. A little bit on my nose, um, under my nose, because my mouth is like, or like around my mouth is just darker for some reason. And then a little bit on my chin to cover my pimple that's healing. Next, I take my beauty blender that is damp, it's by Real Techniques, and I just blend that in. Yeah. And then I go in with this super skinny arched freaking brush and i have black eyeshadow on it and i just go for it with my eyebrows i usually try and do my eyebrows step by step so that they're even rather than eyebrow by eyebrow i don't know if that makes sense and then i took the yellow color corrector again and put it under my eyebrows to accentuate the arch blending time Next, I use e.l.f. Camo CC Cream in the shade 210, I think. And I just blend it all over my face evenly. And I blend, and I blend, and I blend. And then I take this e.l.f. Contour Palette, and I go in with the darkest shade with this really skinny brush. And I go along my jawline, a little bit under my chin, and then on my cheekbones too and on my forehead which i usually don't do but i do for some reason then i blend it out with my other beauty blender after i take this uh oh uh, maybelline uh anti-age rewind thingy concealer and i put that under my nose again and under my eyes and i just blend that again and then I decided to go with the dark contour color again, and I just went over my eyes since I'm going for a little more grungy look, specifically my crease. And then I take the Maybelline powder, I think in 210. I don't know. And then I just pat it all over my face with this big fluffy brush. And I also toned down my eyebrows a little bit with it. And then I press powder with the beauty blender onto my face in specific spots that I know get more oily. And then now to my favorite part is contour time for my nose. This is how I do my contour. I just go pretty basic, like on the crease of my nose, I guess you could call it, where my nose bends up. I don't know. I just trace the natural shape of my bones on my nose my no my big uh yep and then i go with that powder and i go over where i put the contour on my eyes earlier and then i blend that out with the fluffy brush that is usually clean <laughs> and then i take the beauty blender with the powder on it again i go around my nose and i take the white shade and i put it on the tip and the bridge of my nose and I take this black eyeshadow and I like close my eye on the freaking brush. And so it goes on my waterline and I just rub it on my waterline. And I take this blush in the shade Rosy, always Rosy I think. Go a little bit over my nose and then I just pack it on my cheeks. Because I like blush in this shade is a little bit more um, natural I guess. So I want more, but I blend it out with an extra fluffy soft brush. And I also like to darken my little beauty mark so it shows. And then I use the e.l.f. Lash and Roll Mascara. And I didn't put it on on camera because I look stupid when I put it on. 
on. But anyway, so I took the black eyeshadow again and I just lined my lips with it. And yeah. And then I can't remember what shade this is, but it's NYX um, lip thingy. And I put it on my lips. And then I ended up taking this red sparkly eyeshadow and just lining my lash line on top with it and a little bit on the bottom oh also i put mascara on both my eyelashes on my top and bottom lashes and lastly i take this nyx setting spray and i set my makeup and then on to the outfit i am styling this lace beige dress and i put on those fishnets and tights and then I also put on these little pink bows in my hair. Also very Courtney Love, Cappy Allen inspired, very Kinder Horish. And just fluffing up my hair a bit so it doesn't look dumb. I also have this eye girl bow ribbon. <laughs> and I just tied it around my waist because I noticed there was little loops for a belt. And then I put on this choker and then i put on these little mary jane shoes and this flannel and then i grabbed my tote bag that says uh let girls be ugly and strange i'm pretty sure it's by a shop called sour cherry i'm pretty sure and then this is the look yeah tell me if you like it tell me how you like it your favorite part of the outfit whatever yeah Okay, and that was my grunge Kinder Hoyish get ready with me. Very um corny love and freaking Francis Cobain inspired a look with the eye makeup. But um yeah, thanks for watching. Um let me know if you want me to do more videos like this and bye.